welcome to the Deutsche Oper Berlin, uh, to our international live stream of Zandonai's Francesca da Rimini. My name is Lexi Hutton, Alexandra Hutton. I'm a, an Australian soprano and member of the ensemble here at Deutsche Oper Berlin. And maybe you recognize me from earlier this evening in Act One. I sang the role of Francesca's little sister, Samaritana. And in this story, Francesca has now, at this point, moved to Rimini, to the house of Malatesta, and left me behind. So, ich bin schon fertig. Uh, since I have a bit of time, I thought maybe it would be nice for you to come with me hinter der Bühne, so we can do a little tour. Let's break the fourth wall. Come, come and see me. Okay. So, first stop is... This is the Schleusel. It's a little room on the side of the stage. Perhaps you can see behind this curtain through to the Hauptbühne and, hey, hey. we have a special member of our company here. Hi. This is Christine Buffel. She's our Yay. gorgeous souffleur. Um, Christine, can you explain to the people at home who maybe have never heard the word souffleur before what that actually means? What is your job? Well, it's in English, it's known as the prompter. Mm. So the person who gives, who gives lines, if should someone potentially forget something, forget a line or... So you're like a guardian angel? Like yeah. a net, I want to say, you know, yes. in the circus when someone's doing the high jump and it's better to have a That's net. That's right. So. And that happens a lot actually, it doesn't does. it? It certainly does. You can does. just have a complete mind blank in the middle yeah. of a role, even something you've done a thousand times and you guys come to the rescue. Yeah, and we also give... We give cues, we give entrances when sometimes the conductor's got so much going on in the pit. He's got Absolutely. his whole orchestra, he's got a lot of lot of balls in the air, as it were. And mm. so sometimes, or if the singers are facing the wrong way and they can't catch a monitor or something, sometimes we give we give beats or we give we give entrances just when you're not sure. And how are we doing this evening? Have Did you, you really... had to work extra hard or No, if no, no, everyone's really okay. on their, you know, really on their game. It's great. That's fantastic. It's fantastic. It's sounding amazing and everyone's Good. really giving 200 percent so that's exciting very to good watch to hear. Yeah. Well, thanks so much christine right, One more. see you later Bye. okay now we're gonna head through they really are guardian angels I, honestly so come come through with me we're gonna head to the heart of the deutsche oper which is of course our hauptbühne the main stage and i always get excited when i walk through here okay it's quite light right now they i think they have the working lights on ba -ba -da -ba. now perhaps from here you can have a look at the fly tower, which goes all the way up probably, I don't know how many meters that would be. What do you think? We're so lucky here at Deutsche Oper, we have such a big space. On each side of the stage, we have about the same amount of space as we have here on the Hauptbühne, and also double back behind this space as well. Let's keep going across the stage. cleaning the blood off the set. Charming. I'm going to now look for another very, very important person behind the scenes, and that is one of our stage directors, Frank Wesner. Hi, bist du zu beschäftigt oder können wir sprechen? Hast du Zeit? Ist einer Inspin, Inspin, I can never say this word. Inspizient. Inspizient. Or, or in English, Deputy Stage Manager. Yeah, Deputy Stage Manager. Hast du viel zu machen in dieser Vorstellung? Um, das Verrückte ist, uh, ja, durchaus, weil, uh, aus zwei Gründen, weil es mm. sind uh, gar nicht zwar die technischen Verwandlungen, die so viel sind, yeah. aber vor allem sind sehr viele Leute, die immer wieder kommen und immer wieder uh, dann verschwinden und wieder dann gerufen werden wollen. Und dadurch, <lacht> äh, dadurch kommt ihr immer wieder alle bei mir vorbei yeah. und ich habe ständig äh, Auftritte zu geben, aber weil das, das mache ich auch. Auch für die Zuschauer, also ich, ich, ich klingel die ja, ah, äh, sozusagen ja. gebe denen den Klingelzeichen. Ah. Wir hoffen, ja. dass die Zuschauer bald das auch sehen dürfen direkt ja. und damit äh, die Zuschauer hören sozusagen mein Klingeln und dann wissen sie, ah, langsam muss ich jetzt aber auch mal reinkommen. Natürlich. Und, äh, und dann wären das eben die äh, Einrufe während des Stücks und dann, wenn ihr dann da seid, wollt ihr ja auch auftreten. Ihr ja. wisst es eigentlich selber, wann ihr auftreten wollt. Ich weiß, ja. So du und das auch so. eine Engel für uns. Und unsere Kollegen vom Ton sind so gut, dass sie keine, dass sie die Einsätze auch, die haben auch ein Klavier aussuchen, die machen das alles alleine, weil wir haben ja ganz viele Übertragungen mhm. aus dem Orchesterprobensaal, wo eben 
die Damen und Herren des Chores sind, wo Bühnenmusik steht. Wir haben auch Bühnenmusik auf der Seitenbühne, auf beiden Seitenbühnen. Und die müssen eben dann verstärkt werden, übertragen werden. Super, vielen ja. Dank, Frank. Bis später und ja, toi, toi, toi. Finden wir noch was Schönes hier. Ja, genau. ja. Gut, ciao. Ciao, ciao. Ciao, vielen Dank. So, let's keep going this way. Let's stalk some of the performers. I think it's time. They won't mind. It's just a little pause. John, hi. Ah, hi, I'm Sophia. This is Jonathan Tettelman. He's right, Al Paolo. That, I think that's important to mention to everybody that we are being tested daily with a, a little Schnell gargle test. So that's why we're able to get so close to each yes, other. Yes, the spit test. Yeah. Is this the first time you sung this role? Is it a role debut? Uh, yeah, it's, a, it's the first okay. time a lot of people would sing this opera. It's a it's very obscure piece. Yeah, um, yeah. It's probably done, you know, once every 20 years, I feel like. But, uh, but yeah, it's a very new role. It's kind of a new fach for me, too. It's, right, it's so high. teetering between... Uh, you know, uh, lyric tenor and dramatic tenor. Yeah. So, uh, so it's a, it's a bit of a challenge. Are you finding it's a good step in the right direction? It feels good. Or yeah, yeah. Like, I won't keep no, you too thank long you. because thank you. you deserve your pause as well. No, so of we're going to keep going. Thank, thank you. you so much. Cheers, cheers. Ciao, toi, toi, toi. Let's keep going. So let's quickly cross to the Damenseite. But first, I, I really want to show you something here. Come and see this incredible landscape that's part of the set in Act 1 and Act 3, which is here behind me, if you can see. It's a copy of um, a landscape by Claude Laurent, and we're really lucky that we have the man responsible for this here with us, Robert Schulzke. Robert, hast du das allein gemacht? Oder, das oder? Gemälde, nein. Also die, die, die ganze Bühne wurde entworfen von dem Bühnenbildner, und der Bühnenbildner äh, ist Johannes Leiacker. Ja. Und, und das, was hier besonders ins Auge fällt, ist dieser große Rückhänger, ja. der Backdrop auf Englisch. Es ist wirklich ja. ganz, ganz schön, ja. fantastisch. Und wie, viel, wie viele Male waren beschäftigt für das? Das waren nur zwei. Nur zwei? Ja, das ist, man kann eigentlich nicht viel mehr Maler nehmen, weil das muss ja, das ist ja eine, eine Kunst, ein Stil, eine Sprache, eine malerische Sprache. Und da müssen sich schon zwei Maler sehr gut verstehen, dass sie sehr schnell ein Bild in der Größe kopieren können. Also das haben sie in 280 Stunden geschafft. Das wow. waren jetzt, also wenn das zu, äh, zu zweit war, das ein guter Monat Arbeit. That's amazing. I think that's really amazing. And we get to see this in Act 1 and Act 3. Bravo. Es ist fantastisch. Ja. Sehr, Sehr schön geworden. Ja. ja, vielen, vielen Dank. Also, we have to go now to the... Okay. Vielen Dank. We now have to cross over to the Damenseite and say hello to some of our female performers. And if we're lucky, we get to speak with the star of the show, Sara Jakubiak, who sings Francesca. Let's just see if Sara, our star, Sara Jakubiak is here, and if she doesn't mind saying a little hello. Sara, it's Lexi, are you, how are you doing? Oh yeah, she's in mask, she's getting some makeup on. Do you mind if we come in and say hi? Yay! Sarah, yes. you're amazing in this. Uh, How, is this your first time singing this role? Yes, it is. Yes, really? It is. Oh, yes. It's so perfect for you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. But you've been here at the Deutsche Oper with us before. Yes, yes, yeah. for uh, Das Fude de Heliane. Yes, and that was also yes. with Christoph Loy. Yeah. And it's also available on DVD, I believe. <laughs> yeah, just a little plug for that. We're also <laughs> making a DVD of this, which will come out later in the year, I believe. So that's exciting. Um, you have a lot of costume changes. Uh -huh. in this show, but you haven't had one yet, have you? I've had one. You have I've had, had one. one. I went into a suit. Yeah. But there's a lot more beautiful, beautiful costumes Yes, coming there's out. a beautiful dress coming. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. I'm excited, excited about that. Mm -hmm. So we won't disturb you anymore, so you can okay. have a little pause. Thank you so much for Thank talking you. to us. Thank you. You're wonderful. Thanks, Anke. <laughs> one more very important stop is uh, this important dressing room, as you can see. Hutton. And Marero, my gorgeous colleague, Micho Marero. Uh, let's see if she's in the dressing room. Mich, hello. We're not going to have an audience for this premiere. How do you feel about that? Well, to be honest, uh, it's obviously the first time. 
mm -hmm. to, that we will ever have on a premiere without people. Yeah. But I feel like we're just so, every single one of us is so excited and so grateful just to be able to do something, you know? So and baby. it's been so long since we've been like working on this piece and we've grown like this amazing group of people. So I think yeah. we're just gonna put all of our energy and all of our love and passion into it. And Absolutely. hopefully it'll make it as vivid as we would love for people to be with us. Of yeah. course, not in the same way, but we will definitely be giving it all. It's something. Yeah, it's, something. it's, it's more than something really. Yeah. I can't even put it into words. It's, oh no, we, we all feel it's it. It's refreshing. We great. All feel we're it. so grateful. We are. It's just the, we're so this, lucky too. I know. We're really, the really sense lucky. of gratitude and, and all of the opportunity is just unbelievable. Yeah. So I, agree. I gotta go because they yeah, just they called, called me. You already. I did. But go, go, yeah. go, 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 go. <laughs> bye, bye. Have fun. Toy, toy, toy. So Mishot has gone running to the stage and all the other girls have had their call for the start of Act 3, which means that this little pausa is about to finish. So we hope that you enjoy the second half of Francesca de Rimini here at the Deutsche Oper Berlin. We are so pleased that we were able to live stream this for everyone watching at home, but we really can't wait to have everyone back in the auditorium to watch us live and have you here with us. So until then, Viel Spaß, enjoy the show and bis bald. Ciao.